Oh, dude, this thing is just nuts. All right, what's up, guys? Foxy coming to you guys today with a brand new video, or I guess this morning with a brand new video. Hope you guys are all having a fantastic day. In today's video, the season six update is live. So let's go, baby. Let's go. Let's go. Let's clap it up here, bro. In today's video, we're going to be looking at one of the brand new weapons that came with season six. There's two new weapons. We have that s val or the as val you guys know i pronounce everything wrong and we have the spr 208 sniper rifle sniper is insane it's it's nasty we'll cover that tomorrow today we are going to cover the s val or the as val and so i hope you guys do enjoy this video if you guys want me to do a separate video on like the best attachments i can do that but we're just kind of looking at this weapon for now because i was just using it throughout the stream and all that stuff so i hope you guys do enjoy this video if you guys do and you guys don't mind leaving an early like that'd be greatly appreciated subscribe turn on notifications we post brand new content all over we post brand new content on all the new stuff every season and we'll be posting brand new cold war footage and content all year long if you guys have any suggestions on how i can improve the content please let me know down in the comments i'm always reading my comments i'm always responding to them and i'm always checking to see what i can do to make the content better here on the channel if you guys go follow my twitch just down in the description below we stream over there every single night and without further ado let's go bro all right so my opinion well everyone's using the new sniper okay so all right so if you were to ask me what i think this gun looks like i think that this gun looks like the pp90 from modern warfare 3 to be honest it's just is when you look at that that's it's just literally mw3 pp90 in my opinion there you go the, now see here's the problem with this gun in my opinion this gun is pretty good it's not bad the problem i have with it is number one number one the magazine size the magazine size is only 20 and then you can get extended max but it's only for 30. like i think that's way too low i wish there was like maybe like 45 rounds kind of like the a max or whatever but i doubt that'll happen um this guy is actually not moving so we're gonna go kill oh wait no of course i'm getting shot in the back i'm getting shot in the back oh my gosh oh my gosh no you're laying it down in the back what are you doing <laughs> Oh my goodness, bro. Yeah, this sniper rifle is nasty as fudge, dude. Like, here, here, I'm gonna show you guys real quick. Hold on, wait. I'm pretty sure the new sniper is like a one shot anywhere. I might be wrong on that. It's really hard to get a hit marker with this gun. I think the rate of fire on this gun is really, really good too, but it's, I don't know. Right now, I'm running the one, right now I'm running the barrel that has the highest damage, trying to make it the best I can. Like, that's pretty good. Double kill. I don't know, man. It's like, it's like hit or miss, in my opinion. Gun is super hit or miss. Kobe. Oh yeah, they nerfed C4s, by the way. So that, that's another thing in this new update. They nerfed C4s. It's, it's very, very weird. <laughs> they nerfed C4s by a lot. I am pretty surprised at how much they nerfed the C4s in this update. Okay, so let, let me put this into perspective for you. I have amped on, right? Like, that doesn't go anywhere. Now, I've run into a lot of people running the sniper. I feel like every single lobby has someone running the sniper in it. And normally, on DLC days, it's not like that at all. It's really not. <laughs> because normally, you'll have a lot of people running the MP5, which there's one right there on the ground. But you'll also... Dude, like, look at that, bro. Like, you'll have people running the M4 and MP5 and stuff like that. I feel like in this update, there's way more people running the new sniper than ever before. I don't know how I killed him. That hey, UAV. Nice, nice, nice. No, 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 no. Oh, come on, bro. I thought he killed the guy that was over there. Oh, wait. I spawned over here. That's a terrible spawn. That was terrible aim as well. Oh, my goodness. Free for all is my game, man. This is my mode. There's. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, thank God. Here we go. There's another one with this UAV. Nice. Let's go, baby. Let's go. I'll leave the attachments that I'm running on this gun in the com or not in the comments, in the description of this video. So if you guys want to try out this class, you guys can. I don't really know what's the best at the moment because I don't have all the attachments unlocked, to be honest. But yeah, I'll leave that in the description for you guys to check out. If you guys want to use it and you guys do use it, let me know what you guys like on this gun. I really like this gun. I just wish it had more ammo, dude. I wish it had more ammo. So this gun also has these semi-auto 
automatic rounds. If you guys want me to do a video on this, let me know down in the comments and I'll do a video on these semi-automatic rounds. But I just don't know how good they are and we're just gonna run the 30 rounds for now because that's what we're covering. Really don't want to deal with the stress of trying to use these semi-automatic rounds considering that I think there's only 10 rounds. Yeah, it says right here, 10 rounds. I'm sure they're great, but I just don't have the patience to do that considering it's five o'clock in the morning right now. Alrighty then. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, I'm not the biggest fan of all the MP5s I'm running into right now. Or I guess MP5s, M4s. Nope. Like, dude, I can't even make that throw up there anymore. I can't make the throw up there anymore with amp. That's insane. I'm curious as to why they nerfed the C4 this late into the game's life cycle. Like, we don't have very long until Black Ops Cold War comes out, dude. So what was the what, what was the reason for the nerf? Oh, dude, this thing is just nuts. UAV entering the AO. Got a veto on station, ready to deploy. Oh, dude, that was a good snipe. All right, sorry, I was like, I was concentrating super hard right there because I got on a streak. But um, oh, there's a guy up there. Oh, dude. Okay, so, pause. This gun has a really good headshot multiplier, I, I think. I'm probably wrong, because j God's probably gonna come out with a video, or Ace is gonna come out with a video. It's gonna be like, oh, the headshot multiplier's not that good on this gun. But in my opinion, from what I've, from what I've used so far, oh, hey, what's up, dude? It seems like the headshot multiplier is really, really good on this gun. Oh, he was down low. You have to jump to get it up there now. I don't know why. I, it's just, it's weird. It's weird how they nerfed the C4 this or this late into the game's life cycle. A part of me has this like weird conspiracy theory that they nerfed the C4s because everyone knows how the C4s are thrown in Black Ops Cold War. They're really slow and, you know, it's pretty much useless. So I have a feeling that they did that because in Warzone, I don't know, maybe they did it so that way people could get used to how slow the Black Ops Cold War C4 is and like they could use it in Warzone too. I, I don't know. I, I truly don't know. I'm, I'm just kind of lost on why they did it. That's pretty much my theory on it. Conspiracy Theory Foxy coming at you today with a brand new video. Well, that was weird. Honestly, I'm gonna be real with you guys, man. I really like Atlas Superstore because the spawns are really easy to learn. Oh no, that was so close. Spawns are super easy to know, to learn, super easy to spawn trap. And that's super weird because this map sucks for most game modes considering how campy it is. And you would think it would be like super campy in this mode too because free for all is pretty much the campiest mode in this game, but it, it's not in my opinion. Like, or like for this map at least, because if you know the spawns, then you're good to go. And there's, there's the kid camping with a sniper. But it seems like people only sit on this side instead of that side. I feel like, because that other side's a little bit more open. Okay. Oh, hi. Yeah, nice. On the C4 now, when you throw it and you detonate it, you guys hear that beep? There's a beep that goes off before it explodes if you, if you double tap X or double tap square. Can we get something like that for the claymores in this game? Like Modern Warfare 2, where you would hear that sound before the claymore would go off so you can at least back up like a tiny bit. God damn, dude. This gun is... This gun's pretty good, man. I really like this gun. That's a GG, bro. That's a GG. <laughs>